Oh my god. Let's just hope it's still gonna be some money up in here, okay? I fuck with Shawty cause she bought a business, ayy. She independent and she on a mission, ayy. Been through some shit, but now it's better living, ayy. I know that she put in some time. You remind me of me. What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. If you're new here, my name is Honey K and make sure you subscribe because we live over here. Period. Alright you guys, so today is Tuesday and as y'all can see, your girl got her hair done. This wig is in my last upload. This wig is from Nadula Hair. It is a closure, you guys. I just love me a good closure because it's so easy to maintain and it gives my edges a break. So yeah. I just got my hair done today. I love it. Like it's so melted, it's giving scalp. And I'm so happy to have my hair back black. But your girl is in a rush actually because I'm going back to work tonight. Like, it's been like three weeks since I've been to work, which is crazy. I'm going back to work tonight, it's Tuesday. We are gonna see what tonight's talking about. I don't have no nails on, no lashes. So I'm about to do my press-ons right now. Y'all know me, I'm about to do my press-ons and I'm about to do some strips real quick. Call it a day. I got all white press-ons, shorts. I missed having short nails, feeling like I could do whatever I need to do with my hands. And then I got these strips on. I did not miss strips at all. But these strips are like kind of natural and cute. So I just put these on. I'm gonna just do my makeup later on. Good morning guys, today's Wednesday now and I'm feeling good. Like I went to sleep at like five something and it's like 10 right now and I'm up and I'm ready to start my day. Today my bed is gonna get delivered so I'm super happy about that. My new bed is so cute and they're gonna put it up for me because I'm not about to build that. So I paid a little bit extra for them to build it and I still have to go get the mattress. So I'm gonna go get the mattress today. And I'm also literally trying to upload a YouTube video right now and it's making me very upset. It's my birthday vlog. It's making me so mad because I uploaded it twice already. They keep on flagging it for something. I keep on taking parts out that I think they're trying to flag. They're just not approving it. And I want to upload it today, like today's Wednesday. I did not upload on Sunday, so I'm trying to upload it. So that's annoying. But my first day back working, y'all, I felt really good. I miss making money. This shit is so addicting, you guys. It's crazy. I really be in a good mood when I'm making money. I'm straining my money right now, if y'all can't tell. But it was so freaking dry at first. And then this guy came in. And I was like talking to him and I had got a drink with him. He was like, you look so good. I'm trying to get to know you, blah, blah, blah. Y'all know me. I'm going to finesse. Okay, you want to get to know me? Show me you're trying to get to know me. Get a dance from me. And he like, how much should I get? I'm like, you could start off with 600. He's like, okay. And I'm like, shit, I should have said a band. Like, he said, okay, so easily. I was so happy I met him though. Because if it wasn't for him, my bag would have been real small, y'all. Real small. I'm so happy to be back home though, in my motion, making money. Now the focus is trying to get my house together because my house is still empty for the most part. Like I still don't have a lot of stuff. It is December, you guys, and I am going to be doing a giveaway. The giveaway is going to be, you have to answer three questions in the comments. It's going to be a $50 cash app. So you must be subscribed to my channel, you must be an active subscriber, meaning you comment on videos you like videos, you have your post notifications turned on, and you must be following me on Instagram at honeyk 2 easy the honey. That's my name on all platforms. Only platforms I have is Instagram and TikTok. You have to answer three questions about me in the comments down below. Do not say anything in the comments about a giveaway, just answer the questions. The first question is, what did I do before I started stripping? Y'all should know this. That's an easy question, I feel like. The second question is a little harder because I don't know how often I talk about this, but I definitely have talked about it before in a video. How many siblings do I have? This one is gonna be somebody who really pays attention probably. 
And the third question is, how old was I when I moved out? I've said that in the video as well. So those are all three questions. I feel like they're not super hard, but you gotta watch my videos to be able to answer those questions. I will announce the winner in my next video. I will reach out to the winner on Instagram. So when you comment the answers to those questions, make sure you also comment your Instagram because y'all really be supporting your girl. Honestly, that's the least I could do. Yeah, I'm done shaming. Somebody's at my door. That scared me. Hi. Thank you. What happened? No, that's okay. Thank you for bringing it back. I appreciate that. Thank you. That was my neighbor, y'all. I let her use my charger last night. I'm about to run this money. It should be around 600, but let's see. Okay, y'all. So after tip out, your girl came home with $549. So yeah, that tells you how last night was. I literally had that one customer. I was super lucky to get him because it was so dry in it. But it only takes one person, y'all, to change your night. So I was super grateful for this 549 on a Tuesday. Now I'm just waiting for my bed to get here and run some errands and stuff. So I'm gonna bring you guys along with me to do that. So yeah, let me just go ahead and get my day started for real. Dead in my eyes, you see all the times that I had to go slide. Too many sticks, we go to war with whoever ain't never been by. Listen, too many sticks, how was that your ops and none of them died? Listen, hold up, 21, hold up, 21, hold up, 21. Why you pull up at one in the morning and sit on the edge of the bed? Texting emojis, tongue got airplane, must have went over her head. Catching my side of the studio, make him repeat what he said. Listen, yeah, yeah, let's have sex in the car. The Maybach came with a bar. My bed is done. I have to go get my mattress, you guys. But this bed is so cute, y'all. And it's like material. Like, I have to be so careful with this bed. Nobody can touch my bed. No, nothing. Like, it's fabric. And it's like the details are so freaking cute. Oh my gosh. It's a king size, of course. Exactly what I wanted. And the maintenance man is also here. He's fixing the washing machine because my washing machine would not open and my clothes are literally stuck in there. And then as soon as he's done, I'm gonna literally head out. Y'all search for a bed if it's too soft. Is that bad? This, I fell right into this. This feels good. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. I don't want to get a bed that's going to be sunk in, though. I hate when your mattress starts sinking in. I feel like picking a mattress is such a hard decision. Oh, no. I don't like that one. What's good for your back? Firm, medium firm, or plush? Oh no, it's too hard. I like a soft bed. Your boy got the full body do rag out. Chop the roof and let you smoke it. I got diamonds doing since he's slashing both ears. Dice rolling on the Las Vegas strip tonight. Slip that on and we might miss the fight. Fucking not, I keep the koala in my shorty bag. You know she want a mom when she tattooed that ass. I'm a lover boy. She got the toys. Keep it coming, you a rider. Okay guys, I'm back at the crib. I'm about to eat, finish this hair video that I have to post. Make sure y'all watch that video too because that video is gonna be up before this video. So if you ain't watch it, go watch me get my hair slayed because in that video, we got into details about how we get this install so flat like we do, okay? what's up guys so today i sounded mad excited what the heck so today is thursday night now and your girl is getting ready to go to work i did a lot of running around today all freaking day i've been up since nine this morning and i was not gonna go to work tonight but i had got home around like seven i had cooked dinner i ate and everything and i was just chilling me and shy was on the phone i'm like we should just go to work huh she like i was gonna go to work i was like okay 
<laughs> well shoot, let me just go ahead and get up. I'm sleepy, but I could sleep in tomorrow. We about to go to work and I spent mad money today running around all day. I bought some stuff for my house, getting it delivered, all that stuff. This house stuff be adding up, y'all. So I'm like, let me go ahead and go make that money back because that was a lot of money I spent. So we about to see what tonight is talking about. It's Thursday. Let's see how the night goes for you, girl. We are not even going to talk about how I look right now, okay? Let's not even talk about it because it's 5.51 in the morning and I snatched my eyelashes off. I'm so tired and y'all know, let me put y'all back a little bit. I went to the club with barely any sleep. I was already tired, but I'm so glad I went to work tonight, y'all. For a Thursday? Your girl did good for a Thursday. All that money I spent today during the day, I'm pretty sure I made all that back. Spend the bag and make it right back. I even gonna be able to do a full money count though, which I'm kind of sad about because I really want to know how much I made tonight, like in total, because I felt like I had a good night. But I have a bag with just me and Shy, but I'm not gonna be able to count that because she left the club early. So I'm gonna have to count that tomorrow and just add it to whatever I made tonight. Y'all, my friend came in there and literally handed me like 300 just off the, oh, you at work tonight. Here, put this in your bag. I really got some real ass friends, y'all. I swear. Just come to the club and hand me money. And it'd be cool. Cause I don't even gotta do too much, you know? Cause how I know you like me if you ain't spending no money? So I'm about to finish straightening my money and we're gonna do a money count, a partial money count. So I'm gonna have to just do the end count tomorrow. Y'all, my eyes literally burn right now to stay open. I'm finished straightening my money. I have big bills and I have small bills because I turned my ones in and the ones we have this. Oh my god. Like literally y'all, it, it's everywhere. Okay, cool. I'm about to just run this and come back to y'all. In loose bills, I have 78. And then in ones, I have 100, 200, 300, 400, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So that's 978. In ones and then in 20s I have two four six eight that's 80 in 20s so that's a thousand and fifty eight and then in hundreds I have one two three four five six so right now we're at sixteen hundred and fifty eight dollars and then I still have these ones so once I count those ones I'm gonna add it to the sixteen fifty eight I'm gonna screenshot this so I don't forget. And then we'll add whatever this is tomorrow to it. What's up guys? So today is Friday and your girl's about to go out to eat. And then I plan on going to both of my clubs today. Hopefully, if everything works out the way it's supposed to, it's Friday, we are running it up, period. So the outfit for today is Y'all, don't mind my bed. I literally had a whole situation with my mattress. It's coming. Anyways, so I'm just wearing this black top with these green cargo pants and my Rick Owens with a black MCM bag. That's the vibe. Let's go eat because I'm hungry. Oh, I got something that I can lend you. Oh, a piece of mind, baby. Come and get a piece of mind. Yeah. Say you got to work from three to nine. Oh, I get you home by a decent time. Wait, fuck your bed, you can sleep in mine. Yeah, let's make it happen, girl. I need some time. Speaking of time, who stopped it? That's the feeling that I get when we lock lips. I got the weed at the crib and the liquor too. I fuck your soul, I release in your spiritual. I be your muse, bring your easel and pencil suit. Here you go, you try to tease with them pictures. You could ride on me just like you ride the elliptical. She said, I'm trying to keep it tight for my nigga. Girl, I like your last nigga. All I need is mental. You know, I'll work you out, get you right with your physical. Oh, wait, that's another interlude. What's up, guys? So today is Saturday now. 
and we about to do the money count for last night i did not count my money last night i'm off like four hours of sleep y'all and i need to go to the nail shop bad so i need to get my nails done and i need to get my feet done i chipped my big toe yesterday we're going to work tonight again and we can't be looking crazy so we about to get that done but also for thursday's money count i never finished the money count because i had to count the money with shy so i'm going to show y'all what the total for thursday was and then i'm gonna do the money count for last night which was friday night the ikea man delivered my mattress this morning and the craziest thing, y'all, I was like half asleep when he delivered it and I couldn't believe this man was literally asking me what he was asking me. Y'all, last night I lost my little pouch. I be carrying a little pouch in my bag and I be carrying my lip gloss and stuff in it, but I lost my pouch and it had everything. It had all my lip stuff in there. I'm so sad. Now I gotta go get some more. Anyways, so y'all, the Ikea man came and delivered my bed this morning. I had to go downstairs to get them because you can't get on the elevator in my building and go to any floor without the key fob. So I had to go downstairs to get them. And when me and the man was on the elevator, he was like, you know, small talk, like, how are you today? I'm like, I'm good, I'm just tired. And he's like, do you dance? And I was like, like, no, I don't dance. Like for fun, you don't like to dance for fun? I was like, hmm, sometimes. And then he was just like, oh, okay, do you smoke? I'm like, no, I don't really smoke to be honest. And then he's like, well, I got that white stuff, you know, if you need that too. I looked at him like, excuse me, sir. Did you just really try to offer me that? I'm like, Ikea not paying you enough? You trying to sell drugs on the job? Like, what is going on? I was like, no, thank you, I don't do that. And I was really just in shock, like, Ikea. It's a 20. Y'all, last night was cool. It was a cool night. Thursday was better. So today's Saturday. I feel like Saturdays usually be better than Fridays. But okay, y'all, I'm finna finish straightening this money. And then we're gonna do the final money count for Thursday and Friday. Okay, y'all, so I finished counting the money and I screenshotted what I had counted on Thursday for y'all. So it was 1658 before I counted me and Shy's bag last night. So after me and Shy split our money, it ended up being $342. It's 42 and then 100, 200, 300. So 1658 plus 342 equals $2,000 even. So on Thursday, we made two bands. Period. We had a $2,000 night, okay? Two bands on a Thursday. I'm happy with that. And then last night, so in my big bills, I have two 20s. So that's $40. Then I have five. That makes 45. And then I have 75. That makes 120. And then in ones, we have this 100, 200, 300, 400, 500. 600, 700. So 120 plus 700 is $820. So on Friday, we made $820 after tip out. Definitely going back to work again tonight. So, yeah. Well, well, yeah. Look at me dead in my eyes. I know that you know that a nigga ain't lying. Too much respect. All of my shorty BDs, they know not to try. Too much respect. I used to hand out CDs before they would buy. Well, she love me so much, it seems like she buys. Niggas don't know how I live, but that's cause they live at the high, hey. Four S that team stepping on shit to the spot. He brought me the money sealed up, I still had to count it, I cannot just hide. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, let's have sex in the bank. Telling her open a safe. I hate a privileged rapper who don't even know what it takes. The diamonds they hit like a rainbow, that's cause a neck is a frame. Per whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, let's have sex in the nines, do it. Breaking and bending the spine, do it. I hate a privileged rapper that ain't had a hit since he signed still. Niggas be full of excuses that they taking their time. Wow, wow, wow. So my nails are done. They're so cute and short. This is exactly how I wanted them. And I got my toes done. Y'all, okay. Before anybody say anything like, what is this on your foot? It's a scar from my dancer heels. And I have a scar right here from my dancer heels. 
and it literally only happened to this foot and it happened last night this foot it didn't happen to it like was rubbing on my skin and i didn't even know it but i did go to the beauty supply that's by my nail shop and i got some lashes so i had got these lashes and they're magnetic lashes I've never tried magnetic lashes before. So I'm like, let me just try these. Cause it just be like annoying having to put them on. So I'm just like, maybe this will be an easier option for me. So I'm gonna try these out. And then I just got some lip gloss because I lost my lip gloss last night. I really wanted to try one of those lip glosses that like plump your lips up, but they didn't have no good ones in there. I don't even know if it, those lip glosses really even plump your lips up for real or not, but I definitely want to try one. I'll probably get one from Sephora. Y'all, I am about to go home and go to sleep until it's time for me to get ready for work. I'm going to check back in with y'all once I get up from my nap. It's a couple hours later now, and I'm all ready to go to work. It is going to rain tonight, so I kind of didn't want to go to work because I'm like, it's about to rain the whole night. But it's Saturday, so I'm like, maybe it'll still be good, even though it's gonna be raining all night. Maybe people will still be outside. So we just about to go see what a rainy night is giving. Let's just hope it's still gonna be some money up in here, okay? So yeah, let's go make this money, y'all. After the pre hey, yo, what's up guys so today is sunday night now and the last time i talked to y'all was yesterday night before i went to work i believe had a good night y'all after the club i was in a section with some people that i know and after the club they was like we still want to throw some money ended up going to go do a private party for them and they had threw some more money so then your girl made money there and yeah yesterday was just a good night for me i didn't end up going to sleep until 12 o'clock so I was up like a whole 24 hours basically. So I didn't wake up until like 7.30, almost 8 o'clock. And then when I woke up, I'm like, well, I'm not going to be doing nothing right now. So I might as well just get up and get ready for work, you know? But then I was like, it's Sunday and it's going to rain again tonight. So I just feel like it might not be as good as yesterday because it was Saturday and it's going to rain. I don't know. But I kind of wasn't in the mood to go anyways. And my boo just hit me up. I'm finna send you an Uber, get dressed. So I'm kind of like, I'm not trying to let like a dude make me not go to work. That's not the case. I low-key didn't want to go anyways. So the fact that he just was like, I'm finna send you an Uber, we finna go out. I'm like, okay, well shit. I'm just finna go out. And I was gonna go tonight, but I'm just not in the mood. So I am gonna do a money count for y'all, but I'm not gonna do it right now because I actually need to put some clothes on and leave because my Uber's gonna be coming in like 20 minutes. I'm gonna do a money count for y'all tomorrow. What's up y'all? So it's Monday now and last night I had went out. I got lit y'all. I didn't record nothing. My bad. Don't hate me y'all. I still have to do Saturday's money count. So I'm gonna do that when I get home. Right now I'm about to go hang out with my best friend and my goddaughter. We're about to do like some house shopping and stuff because I'm still trying to get stuff for my house. I have ordered a lot of stuff. I'm gonna show y'all. I ordered so much stuff from Amazon. It all came in the mail. For my bathroom but we about to go to a bunch of stores right now and do some house shopping and i'm bringing y'all with me so let's go she putting this big old thing on her y'all mm. <laughs> it's snowing outside y'all <laughs> harley said i'm about to be sweating mom you look so cute <laughs> you look so cute mom <laughs> okay, you ready? Yeah, I gotta get a beanie. <laughs> Got her strapped up, y'all. We about to go up in these stores. I got bags under my eyes. I need to really like get some sleep. This is crazy. Mm -hmm. oh, shit. Where the key? <laughs> Baby, I never wanted you to stay too long. Just wanted you to show me up. So won't you say my name, say my name If you claim you yeah, want this is cute. me Just, I just want to put it somewhere mm -hmm. That's cute AF Baby, you can 
girls that playing games, playing games. Surprisingly, I didn't find nothing in her legs. We did not come from Harley, but I have to get this for her. This is so cute. <laughs> You a big girl? I'm just trying to match your words with your actions. I need more than satisfaction. Did you really feel that action? You really want to give your arm with legs in front of your friends. How that works. Hey! In this first half, Georgia City gets a chance. Look at yourself. It's you. Hey, you got a chance to What's up y'all? So it is officially Tuesday now and I still have not did Saturday's money count. We about to do this money count first and then we about to do this bathroom. I'm just sad I couldn't find all the stuff that I wanted as in decor wise, but I don't want to be rushing and I'm buying stuff that I didn't really want. All right y'all, so these are my ones that I straightened out from Saturday night. I'm about to run them in the machine. And then these are my big bills because I got my big bills from the club. Y'all know we gotta turn our ones in. So these big bills are from the club and then these ones are from the private party that I did. I like to always double check my money when I get home. And I keep track of how much I make every time I work. So I need to have an accurate count for every single month. So that's why I like to recount my money and make sure everything's accurate. I can't be pale on my casket, make sure I die with a tan, it's part of the brand. I know that I came with a slide from left to right, but now I don't wanna dance. Can I depend on a man? I slide some bread in the jam, that's just who I am. Custom just waving at us. So in our ones, this right here. So this is 100, 200, 300, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So that's 1100 in ones, plus we have six extra dollars. So that's 1106 right now. And then in our big bills, which I didn't even fix them yet. I like all my money to be facing the same way. So we're going to do the tens first. We have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. So we're at 1206 right now. And then we have our 20s, which I kind of want to run these and I don't want to count them. Seven hundred and twenty. That is nineteen hundred and twenty-six dollars. So your girl made nineteen twenty-six on Saturday. I want to show you guys some of the stuff that I got yesterday, and I'm gonna open up these packages with y'all. This package. Oh, I know what this is. This is my candle lighter, you guys. I was previously using lighters to light my candles, but this is like rechargeable. So that way I could just charge this and just reuse it over and over. Ooh, so you just slide it up like that. Let me see, I'm gonna light a candle, hold on. And then this is all the stuff that I got yesterday. I got some pillows, some king size pillows for my new bed. I got toilet paper because I needed some toilet paper. We got a yoga mat, y'all. Okay, the reason I got this yoga mat is because in my building, they do yoga every Wednesday. So I was like, I really want to take the yoga class because I've never done yoga. And I feel like it's all about like flexibility. I want to be like really flexible and really fit and stuff. So I feel like yoga is really good for that. And it seems hella peaceful. So it's like, I want to try to join the yoga class that they have every Wednesday. So I'm like, if I buy the mat, then I'm going to make myself go because I got the damn mat. A shower mat organizer. I'm trying to like have my bathroom really organized. I'm really trying to have my whole house really organized. And then I got these house shoes. They were really comfortable. 
So I got these little house shoes to walk around the house in. Only shoes you can wear in here is house shoes that do not go outside. Some paper towels. I got this candle. This candle smells so good and it's cute. And it's gonna go with the aesthetic for my bathroom. And then I got this candle. This candle is vanilla and amber. I got some cotton pads. I'm gonna turn the light on because it's kind of getting dark. And then I got some more teeth whitening strips because I ran out of those. Some pimple patches because I ran out of those. Got these cute, I want to say like sports bra or bralette. I got these in a size small. I got a black one and then I got a white one. They were like $8 at Target. I thought they were really cute and I like to wear like sports bras and stuff. I don't wear bras. The last one I got from Target, Panoxyl Acne Wash. It's the Benzoyl Peroxide Maximum Strength. I heard that this is really good. I did hear that it dries your skin out though. So you need to make sure you're moisturizing when you're using this. I also heard that this is not a wash that you would use every single day. And it's the maximum strength without a prescription. Power liner. And then I got this candle from Burlington too bin that has like a where did i get this from i got this from burlington i really got this just to put my flat iron and like my wand and my curling iron and stuff like that we also got these brookstone hangers for my closet i want to do all my hangers velvet black and then last but not least i got this really cute nose ring y'all can't even see it though it's like a flower nose ring. If y'all can see it, it's a flower. I don't know if y'all can though. I'm not really into the nose rings that like dangle in your nose. But yeah, that's everything I got yesterday, which I still need to get more stuff. But yeah, now I'm about to play some music and I'm about to tackle this bathroom. Okay y'all, so my bathroom is completely empty as y'all can see. I took everything out. Deep clean the bathroom. Now I'm about to transform the bathroom with everything that I got. Five in the morning, I wake up to find for my eyes. Yeah, in my mind is a warning. Pray to the one you're relying. I've been wondering all day. Tried to be fine, but I thought back. The noise in my mind wouldn't leave me. Try to get by, but Take a food break. So yeah, I was finna put my shower curtain up and I was looking for the shower rods that I bought literally yesterday and I can't find them. So now I have shower rods to hang my shower curtain. The taco looks so good. The soap I don't have no cheese on it. I'm finna eat this y'all and then I'm gonna finish the bathroom. <laughs> These are called cotton rounds. That's what the package say. So am I supposed to put cotton swabs on the label? Or am I supposed to put cotton balls on the label? Alright y'all, so there's like a few things that I'm like, okay, I'm missing. I actually have to take some stuff back as well. So I'm going to show y'all how far I got. So when you walk in the bathroom, I have my scale right here. I wasn't really sure if I wanted to leave it right here, but I don't know where else to put it. So I just left it there. And then I have my rug. And then right here, I have this white cotton candle that I got. I want to put a vase here with pumpus in it on top of like a wood round thing. I just have to find it. Y'all will see once I find it whenever. And then over here we have our soap dispenser, toothbrush holder, all that stuff. That's like my face scrubber. And then we have our Q-tips and our... Okay, so I don't know. This is called cotton pads, but... It was either cotton swabs or cotton balls, and I just put cotton swabs. I probably should have put cotton balls, but whatever. Y'all know what it is. 
And then over here I have my toilet paper in this little basket, which I actually wish I would have waited to get this basket because I found a bigger one at Burlington the other day, but I already got this one from Target, so I just kept it. Toilet scrubber, my trash can. Ooh. My trash can. I also need to get a toilet cover thing. And then over here we have this area which is not finished this white bin which has my hot like flat iron and my hair tools and stuff in there and then these towels and i just tied this little piece on the towels which wasn't even part of the plan but that this thing came with this and i was like that'd be kind of cute so i tried to tie it in like a little bow i feel like that looks cute and it goes with the aesthetic. And then we have these books I ordered from Amazon. They say faith, hope, and trust. They're not real books, they're just like decor books. And then we got bath salt right here. And we got the hourglass. And then over here, I'm gonna have my laundry stuff. I just need to get something for my dryer sheets. And then I'm also gonna put some type of decor thing right here when I find one. I don't really like that the laundry detergent is blue, but it is what it is. And then these, this is a scent booster, which it didn't have the label for scent booster. So I wrote it on there, but I don't like how it looks at all, like ill. So I turned it around, but I still know what it is because it's still labeled on the back. My dryer sheets in front of here, and it's gonna have a label that says dryer sheets. So I feel like it won't look bad once I get that. And then once I get some type of decor piece next to it, it won't look too bad. And the detergent is kind of like in the corner. So when you're like right here, you don't really see it. So I feel like it's okay. Back over here really quick. I have my morning routine stuff organized. And then in here, I just have, right now I only have these clips in here, but I'm gonna have like my hair stuff in here. And then in this last drawer, I have all my wigs in here, like, and my braiding hair and stuff like that. That's what's in here, cause I didn't know where else to put it, so. And then in here, it's empty right now because I'm waiting to get my clear bins so I can label them and put all my the rest of my stuff in here. And then I'm going to put these picture frames on the walls, but I don't have no nails. I thought it came with nails, but it didn't. It came with everything else but nails. And then my shower curtain, I'm waiting on the shower hooks because I lost them. Like I told y'all, I don't know where they are. The white shower caddy, which I want to get white bottles and label them to put my soap and stuff in them. And I still need to get a new shower head. And then I just have some towels right here. I had to switch over to my phone, y'all, because my camera died. Laundry area, y'all. Okay, let's talk about it, cause I'm annoyed. So I didn't realize that this thing that I bought to like, you know, cover the washer and dryer, I'm not gonna be able to use it because it's supposed to be in a doorway where you can have the top of it reaching the ceiling. So the top of this does not reach the ceiling. And the reason it's supposed to be like that is because it's supposed to be on a track, which I have the other piece. Let me show y'all. This track, the top of it, but the thing is not tall enough to reach the ceiling, so I can't have it on this track. So with that being said, I have to return this. And I'm just going to go ahead and wrap this video up because I'm not working tonight and I'm not working tomorrow night. And I need to edit this so I can have it up for y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Make sure you don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Make sure you turn your post notifications on so you can be notified every time I post a video because who don't want to watch my videos? Everybody wants to watch my videos, period. Love you guys. Fuck niggas still can't believe I used to fuck with you. I've been playing bees cause I ain't playing to be stuck with you.